Hello everyone, welcome back to Minding the Gap. I'm Sue Hodgman and this is Greg Allen behind the camera. We're bringing you some helpful information on taking care of yourself emotionally and mentally during and after this COVID emergency. In collaboration with San Juan County, San Juan Safe Communities and the Mental Health Task Force, we're giving experts a few moments to share helpful ideas and tips on important subjects like anxiety, depression, grief, and many other important issues we're all facing right now. Today we have Dr. Amber Layton of ATB Behavioral Health Services. She'll be talking with you about suicide. Hello, my name is Dr. Amber Layton with ATB Behavioral Health Services, here today to talk about suicide and COVID-19. We have been asked to social distance ourselves due to the spread of COVID-19. While it's important to keep ourselves and others safe, we need to be mindful of this as a physical distancing and that it's beneficial for us to be more socially available to all. Suicide that occurs during times like this is often impulsive, which means we absolutely have to engage with others and break isolation. This does not mean to ignore the six foot distance and safety precautions, but instead we need to call, Skype, or whatever we can to keep in social connection with all of our friends, family, and loved ones. If someone you know is talking about suicide, I encourage you to talk with them. This will not cause them to commit suicide, but will offer them connection and possibly hope. Also remember that we have suicide hotlines that are available 24-7. 1-800-273-8255 or a crisis hotline that you can text home to 741-741, as well as taking the individual to the emergency room. Even during a public health crisis, you can take suicidal individuals to the emergency room for a higher level of care. While COVID-19 is tough for all of us, we can all do our part to be social and talk with others during this time. Thank you, Dr. Layton. You can reach out to Dr. Layton at the information listed on the screen. We'll be bringing you another Minding the Gap episode soon. And in the meantime, our resource page can be found at the San Juan County website, the San Juan County Safe Communities website, and the Mental Health Task Force Facebook page.